What is up, guys? We have to get going today quick. We got some snow plowing to do. And let's jump in the comments. Let, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go over the comments first. It looks... Okay. The back end looks freaking sweet. Look at that. The mud flaps, everything like that. The hitch. I, I, I like the hitch these guys play on. The little drop hitch. I like that. What? Do, how big of exhaust is that? Oh... 5 inch, 4 inch, I don't know. But the 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 thing, the reason, the real, real re reason I chose this today is because of the tires. Look at those. Those are monster. Those are sweet. Like, I'm, I'm the type of person that wouldn't like too crazy of tires, you know? Like, too aggressive, big and stuff. But I just like regular size, just real grippy. Like those. These are sweet. And these will handle in the snow great. It looks like, doesn't it look like the bed is a different color? I would assume they did that. I would guess they did that on purpose. I'm like really sure they did that on purpose. But we got to get going. And we have to go to our past job site. Pick up the trailer. Uh, load the skid steer. And move to the next one. That's the plan. And it's hard seeing these roads when the, when the roads aren't plowed. And they're covered with snow. Looks like somebody should be plowing those. I think there is a plow truck. Maybe we could... Uh, buy that for the next snow plowing video and i usually do get a lot of comments are like it's summer man why are you snow plowing well everybody needs to go back to winter a little bit you know once you once you're with summer forever you get, start getting bored and stuff and you want a different type of season i'm i'm so 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 ready for the fall I, we go camping in the fall we do awesome things in the fall and the weather is so much cooler like it's not that it's too hot in iowa it's just it's just that it's so humid in Iowa, and I'm sure other states are even worse, but yeah. Okay, let's get this loaded. Let's see if we can line up the hitch, the ball. Right there. Right there. There we go. And let's throw in the skid steer, boys. JCB, raise her up. And... I think last time the problem I had with this is the boss plow, the boss box plow would not go in here like correctly. Like it would either go through the wooden floor of the trailer or it would just like tip and fall off and roll the slide even if I had the load locked and I had a problem with that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it on the JCB and just put it up high. That may be kind of illegal. Honestly, I'm not sure if there's rules about that, about how high you can have that legally. But we're going to do it just so we don't hit other traffic. And I know there's no semis around, but hopefully we won't hit other traffic. That's the plan. I want to get the skid loader over the wheelbase a little more, but hopefully those ramps don't hit that. That, that, should, be, that should be good, I would assume. And let's raise the ramps. X. There we go. Lock the load. Get hauling, boys. We'll get hauling. Like, this This Cummins pulls like a dream. It seriously does. But I'm going to kind of try and take it slow. I think. I think we're going to try, try and take it slow. It seriously, it seriously pulls so good in the snow. It just, like I, what way are we going? We're going to go left. We're going to go left. I think it's left is where we're going. But anyways, this thing pulls awesome, man. It just, it just does the trick. It literally does the trick. Going up this hill and hopefully it's not icy on the way down. Ah, ah, we're going to die. No. No, the Cummins got it. The Cummins has it. The Cummins can handle it really well. I I love the new miles an hour down here. And it's probably a little dangerous, but we're going to pass this car. We're going to fly by her. Oh, we got to do it. We got to do it before the other car is coming. Come on, Cummins. Oh, let's play chicken. Oh, we just... Oh, there's a skid loader on. Okay, it's, it's on still. Oh, oh, what's up, boy? We made it. We, hopefully we don't go sliding. Hopefully we just go up right up here. Hmm. 
Here we go. Go up here and let's park the trailer. We'll just park the trailer back over here. Right there. Right there. Unlock the load. Should be good. And let's throw her up. Put it down. Go down. Go down. Go down. Should we drop the blade right now? Should we just drop the blade right now right as we get off? No, we can't. I that'll, It'll just be at a way too weird of an angle. I think. I think. I think. It's hard to get this angle with this box blade. That's why I don't like using it. But then again, it does get the job. Turn on the shield. Go. There we go. Like, it clears it so much faster. But the fact that it's so big is when you're on hills and stuff, it's really uneven. And it can miss some. It can definitely miss some in between. What I want to do is I want to push the snow up over the edge. That's... That's really the plan, so that way when it melts, it'll melt down in the hill and destroy those, like, holy crap, those are huge houses. It'll basically flood those huge houses, because I don't give a crap about those rich guys down there. No, I, I do. That, that That's not the right way to think. That's not right th the right way to think. But anyways, we're still going to do it, because we can. It doesn't it doesn't that look like it, like it's not level with the ground? It I don't know. It kind of looks like it. Let's lift it up. Go back a little bit and then we'll get closer to the house. I think if the skid loader can make it up the hill, it can. Oh my gosh, see when it's not level with the ground, it's really bad on on hilly terrain. It's really bad. That's definitely not level with the ground. There we go. We'll go right over here, push it up against the wall. But then, I'm, okay, so I'm going to do a pass pushing it up against the house. And then I'll do a pass where I clear the snow out from underneath the house. From that big pile I pushed. Out to the fence. I'll just back drag it. I think. Okay, I, got, I really got to raise it up so I can see a little better. But yeah, I think that's the plan. If we can... Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. There we go. Okay. I wonder how the... Oh, the visibility in the back is great. Which would be like, honestly, like actually operating one. Like fully operating one. They, the interior looks sweet and the visibility... The vis visibility is everything in skid steer. It definitely is. So we'll back drag this a little bit. I don't really want to run into the the fence though. That's good enough. And then can we get through here? <sighs> this w no, there's no way we can we can get through there. No way at all. So, let's go clear the front a little bit, I think. I think if there is a yeah, there there's a driveway. But this hillside is going to be definitely tough. If we can get around the house. We got around the house. Now we got to speed it up and go forward. Oh, drop it. Oh, shoot. See, this hillside is really, really challenging. I'm trying to get it. I'm, I'm really trying to get it. There we go. There we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. We just hit the railing. No, no. I don't even have insurance, man. Oh, my bad. We need to back drag this stuff. Why am I pushing up against the guards? We need to back drag this stuff. <laughs> oh, the first sneeze of the squad. Oh, is that the first sneeze? It is. That's crazy. That's crazy. After 25K subs, we finally got our first squad sneeze. Wow. Wow, that is crazy. I'm surprised. That felt good. It always feels so good to sneeze sometimes, unless you're like in public or a huge crowd and you sneeze on somebody. Then uh, you don't really get the best expression back from the people you sneezed on. They really, they really don't like that. It's, it's not a good idea to sneeze on people, guys. Okay, now let's push it out towards the road and try not to hit a car. That's the, if we 
Can, can we hit a car? No, hopefully we don't hit a car. Hopefully, hopefully we don't hit a car. Should we just, should we not even look? Should we just go? Uh, I don't, I don't think there's any cars coming anyways. I can't tell really where the road ends. Oh, right there. Right there is where the road ends. And I think the driveway is a little wider. It's hard. I wish these driveways had those markers. I really do. Lower it a little bit and then we'll go. We'll go. Bush, 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 bush. There we go. This, see, this is a little easier. We don't have as much snow at all in here. There we go. I, I'm definitely liking this first person view in the skid steer, especially in the skid steer because of the visibility in the skid steer. Back her on up, drop her down, hammer it, put the hammer down, go. I would say that's about good. Where are we getting caught up at though? That's a problem. It must have caught the edge of the concrete. These roads must not be in too good a shape. And then what we're going to do is we're going to load her up, head back, and drop it off at the lot we rented. Oh, wheelie! We just hit a wheelie! We just hit a wheelie! And I want to back it up. And you really always want to keep this kids your backed up on a trailer. Definitely. It's a be better idea than forward. But sometimes you, sometimes you got to face it forward. Load it up from the front. Sometimes you just have to. And we'll lock the load. I'm hoping, I'm really, 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 really hoping in that in FS 2017, they have like tie downs or something. Like actual tie downs on the trailer. Wouldn't that be sweet to have tie downs? But the thing is, I don't think Giants is too much about the towing and hauling aspect as much as we are. The squadrons, the squad in general. Loads locked. Let's go. Is there a road? up here is that a road is that what that is I don't think there is maybe there is I guess we'll just have to it looks like there's a curvy road down there maybe up here there is a curvy road anyways we're not gonna we're not gonna go that we're just gonna go from the same road we came from I think it's the plan that way we can go through our freshly plowed driveway Cummins, Cummins just does great pulling it, pulling it. Oh, right when I say great, I, oh shoot, I did not think about that. Oh gosh, oh that's why, that's probably why our Cummins like literally just stopped. I really need to watch stuff like that. I to like you, you guys know how it is. Sometimes you totally just forget the trailers even back there. Sometimes, especially with this much power in the truck, I, I literally can't even tell tell us back there oh another skid steer wheelies skid steer wheelies are sweet and awesome back her up back her up right there there we go flip up the ramps lock the load okay hopefully i don't hit anything else that's the goal go up here this thing just climbs like a monster oh our load's not locked Go up here. Go through the little town. Oh, I was wondering what that was. I was like, is something like tailgating right behind me? Like, what is that? Okay. Actually, you know what? We'll just head to our next job site. Back to the... Okay, hopefully that doesn't hit that tree. Is that going to hit that tree? I think it's good. Nope. It, it, it hit the tree. Okay, I should have lowered that. What did we hit? What is happening? Oh, we put the ramps down. That's what I did. Okay, we really got to be careful for these trees and poles and everything. This is crazy. This is really wide loop road. Load. 
And we are to our next job site. Just about there. Oh, we are going way too fast down this hill. We are going to skid out. Well, it breaks good down the hill. It really does. Just doing this little cabin is the next job site. Back her in. If I can. If I can get on the first try. Can I get on the first try? Up here. Oh. Without hitting the house. Oh, wow. That thing just whipped around fast. Now I want to pull forward a little bit. Right there, I'd say, is good. Good enough. We'll unattach it. And then we'll probably head away. Oh, this Cummins just flies up the hill. Look at that. That's sweet. That's sweet. The Cummins, the Cummins is freaking beats. This Cummins is a... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys for watching. Go check out my Instagram. Thanks. <laughs>